Okay, people, this is Hope Road 1127. Obviously, Justin again, starting my second Let's Play. On Super Metroid. A more interesting game than Top Gear 2. Of course, Top Gear 2 is a fun game to play. Maybe not so fun to watch. Which is why I uploaded like... 9 videos in one day, just to, you know, get it out of the way. So I can start my second Let's Play. Yeah, I started a game, but... Uh, it was way over the time limit, so... <coughs> just do that. And of course I won't talk during the intro, just to set the mood. Okay. Oh no! Under attack by who, I wonder? I'm sure a lot of you already know. Probably already seen this game a lot. <clears throat> Probably played it too. If you haven't played it, you're missing out on a great game, actually. Of course, I'm using keyboard controls, so... Just bear with me. Like that, you know. For some reason I kept pressing the jump button. Eventually I'll get my gamepad probably for Christmas, which is coming up pretty soon. Which is when I'll actually be able to play like a normal person. Look at all those sleeping people. I wonder what's in here. Nothing. Whoops, next door. <laughs> Ooh, the larva. Can't seem to pick him up. Hmm. Hello. Oh no. Come on, get up there. Please. Of course, there's two ways to kind of get out of this fight. Oh no, he knocked me off. He doesn't usually do that. Not doing good. You can make him drop the Metroid larva, or you could just get hit a whole bunch of times. And then he'll just run away after you have low health. 
so it's impossible to die during this fight. But I like to have some fun and try to make him drop the Metroid larva. But I don't think I'm gonna do that. So I get hit like one more time. Come on, drop it, drop it. Come on, drop it. Yes! That was close. Now for the escape sequence, which is pretty cool. Or self destruct sequence. Same thing, you're escaping from the spaceship thing. Let's go, let's get out of here. Oh. It's a good thing those don't hurt you though. Else it would be a lot harder. A lot harder. It'd also probably give you a bit more time. But it doesn't hurt you, so that's good. Oh. Uh, okay. Don't. Go. Holy crap. Okay. Don't do what I did last time. Last video I fell off pretty much. But I still made it. Ooh, I did better last this video. Last video I had like 10 seconds till it blew up. I almost failed. It would have been embarrassing to fail on the first, pretty much, the first escape sequence, so. Of course, there's only, I think, two in the game where something blows up. Now, I probably won't be able to stop it where well, I stopped it before because that was a 12 minute long video. And if I cut that out, it just would have been weird and. I would have. Yeah, I just. I don't know. I didn't want to cut anything out. So I'll just stop it whenever. Oh, move. Since there's no enemies right now, it's really easy to get around. I would stop jumping, I need to shoot. God, a gamepad would make this so much easier. <clears throat> yeah, nothing much happening right now. Okay. Nope, oh, let's... There we go. If you've played Zero Mission, this might look familiar. Actually, yeah, it will look familiar. I'm gonna pause it and check how long this video is, and might stop and I might not. We'll see. Okay, we are back after pausing the video. I think I might just go and get the Morph Ball and then stop the video there. Of course, that looks familiar. Obviously, the old Mother Bin used to be there when you uh, beat her the first time. Come on, go down. <coughs> Look at Samus Blink as she goes down the elevator. Okay. Get the morph ball, morphine ball. Let everything know we're here by letting the camera see us. And yeah, I think I'll stop the video here. See you guys.